God can make us whole again. God can make us whole again. There's somebody out there that need to hear the word of God. God can make you whole again. If God, if God can make dry bones, hear the word of God. God can make you be whole again. Well, I say, if God can make dry bones, God told Ezekiel, Ezekiel, I want you to preach to these graves. I don't want you to preach to these, these people that are dead. And when you preach to them that are dead, I want them to hear the word of God. And the Bible say when, when Ezekiel say, and preached the word of God, the bones came back together and the bones had flesh on them and the bones were alive again. So what? The bones hear the word of God. Never instant, God can make you whole again. The woman that was occupying Elisha, hey, glory to God. When she occupied Elisha, Elisha say, Gehazi, go call this woman. And she told him, what do you want the, the, the prophet to do for you? And she say that I want, I have everything, but Gehazi told Elisha, she don't have a son. So go to God. Elisha told the woman, by the same time next year, you're going to have a son. And the Bible says she had a son. And she's an old woman. And the Bible says the son went down to see the father. And he said, Father, my head, my head. And the Bible say he died. And when the, when the father knew that the son died, he, he told the servant, go give it to his mother, like a typical father. When the Bible say that how when this woman, the Shudamite woman heard, glory to God, that her son was dead, she said, saddle, saddle the ass, saddle the donkey. I must go and see the man of God. And, and she told him, don't slackle, don't slack, don't slack, don't slackle at all. Don't slack on your, on your going to the man of God to get, glory to God, my son to be healed. And when when Elisha saw the woman from afar here, from far away, Elisha said, "Is all things well? Yes, all things are well." And then Elisha say that glory to God, that it was hidden from Gehazi, but it was revealed to him. And she told the woman, "Is thy son well? Is thy husband well?" She said, "It shall be well. You can be whole again." And the Bible say that how El El Elisha. Elisha told Gehazi, take my, take my stick and go to the son, go to the boy and lay my stick upon him. But it didn't work. So the Bible says that Elisha went into that room because the, the, the woman laid the child, he go to God, on Elisha's bed. Hallelujah, glory. I love the word of God. You can be whole again. Hey, glory to God. Then the Bible say that that didn't work. So Elisha went to the room and it laid upon the sun. He lay eyeball, eyeball, nose to nose, and mouth to mouth, and hand to hand. And the Bible say, glory to God. He did it three times and the boy sneezed and came back to life. You can be whole again. The same God that Elijah, Elisha, Glory to God, serve in the same God that I serve. Hey, glory to God, you can be whole again. But it don't stop right there, my friend. Hey, glory to God, if you know the woman, glory to God, the man that was at Bethesda for 42 years, he, he went there to see the movement of the water. Hey, glory to God, hallelujah. And the Bible say, glory to God, when Jesus saw the man, the man started making excuses by saying, every time I go, somebody comes in front of me. But my message today is, you can be whole again. Hey, glory to God. Then God told, Jesus Christ told him, get up and walk. Hey, glory to God. And the Bible say, the man walked. Glory to God, hallelujah. Another story, my friend, this woman been, been in. Been over 18 long years, 18 long years, hunched over. She couldn't walk, my friend. She was walking like this. Hey, glory to God, walking like this. And the Bible says, woman, thou art loose 
from thy infirmity. <laughs> Glory to God. And the Bible says she stood up straight and she was womb. She was she was healed from her infirmity for 18 long years. What I'm saying to you, my friend, you can be whole again. Hey, glory to God. This woman, this woman, glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. She was at an issue of blood for 12 long years. How many years? 12 long years. Spent all the physician, spent all the money on physician. She got worse than better than somebody say, glory to God. I heard Jesus coming to town. Hey, glory to God. When Jesus came to town, my friend, the woman, glory to God, she pressed away. She got on her knees and touched the hem of Jesus Christ's garment. And the Bible say she was healed immediately. Hey, glory to God. And Jesus Christ said, who touched me? And Peter said, Lord, you see all the people around you? You say, who touched you? Jesus Christ said, for, for, for virtues and went out of me. So I'm saying to you, my friend, the first, the, the five people, glory to God, I mentioned, the dry bones, glory to God, hallelujah, the woman that lost her son because he had a headache, glory to God, hallelujah, and, and hallelujah, the woman that have a, uh, the man that was at Bethesda for 42 years, he glory to God, and the woman that had a uh, hunchback been over 18 long years. Hallelujah. And glory the woman that issue of blood, glory to God for, for, for 12 years. All those people were made whole. So my, my, my assignment today is to tell people the reason why those five people brought to God that was healed. Hallelujah. They was whole again because, number one, they heard the word of God. If you can't hear the word of God, the Bible says, I sent forth my word and healed them. That's number one. Oh, glory to God. What did he say? He sent forth his word and healed. Them. Number two, that woman, glory to God, she had, a, she had a positive attitude. Not just a positive attitude, she kept her po a co composure. She said, it shall be well. She spoke those things into existence, even though her child was dead. What well, I'm saying to you, somebody that's out there. Hey, glory to God. You got to glory. look beyond the situation. You got to look beyond. I ain't telling you to have positive thinking now. Go positive thinking ain't going to save you. What save you is what you say. Hey, God, what save you, what save you is what the word say. If you are sticking on the promises of God, my friend, God will bring it to pass. <laughs> glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And the next one, the man that was at a pool, you can't be complaining. You got to praise God. You can't excuses, my friend. You got to praise God in spite of. The man say, every time I get into it, somebody go in front of me, but glory to God. Hallelujah. You can't find excuses, my friend. And the last one, the woman that had the issue of blood for 12 long years, glory to God, she pressed. Hallelujah. What happened? Press. The Bible said press toward a mark of the high call of God, which is Christ Jesus, our Lord. So the five instant, I'm telling you, you can be whole again. Hey, glory to God. What's stopping you? Glory. You might look. Let the decree have been signed. Yes, the decree have been signed by you. Oh, oh, glory to God. Look at Daniel. Daniel knew that this decree was signed against him. But Daniel said, I've been doing it for a long time. Whether I get put in the lion's den or not, glory to God, I'm going to still trust God. What I'm saying to somebody right now, you can be whole again. The same God that Daniel served, the same God that, glory to God, that woman that lost her son served, the same God that we serve, God have not change. Well, I say God have not changed, my friend. He said I'm the same today, yesterday, and forevermore. God, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, and the God of Jacob is still here. Glory to God. You can be whole again. Hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I'm telling somebody right now, my friend, if you trust in the God that I trust, hallelujah, you can be whole again. The doctor might walk out on you, but the Bible says, who report do you believe? I believe the report of the Lord. Oh, glory to God. I feel like shouting. Can somebody shout for me? Glory to God. David said, I will bless the Lord at all times. And his praise shall continue to be my mouth. My soul shall make a boasting, Lord. The humble shall hear thereof and be glad. I come and tell somebody, you can be whole again. Hallelujah. Whole, whole, whole. Glory to God. This little girl, hallelujah, she was dead. And they was, they was laughing and saying, she's dead. Why Jesus going there? Jesus Christ put him out and went there and touch the little girl and say, Tulis that Kumai, which means daughter, rise. And the Bible says she's a rose. She arisen, my friend. Not only that, glory to God, Elijah, 
Uh, Elisha, oh glory to God, Elijah, hey glory to God, hallelujah, glory to God was dead for four, four days, my friend, the Bible says he stink now, Elias, oh glory to God, hallelujah, he was stink for four days, how much days, he was stink for four days, hallelujah, and he say, Elijah, come forth, hallelujah, and the Bible says he came forth, with grave clothes and Jesus Christ loose him and let him go. What I'm saying to somebody, my friend, the same God that we serve, hallelujah, glory, glory to God, the same God, glory to God, that told a dead man that been dead for four long days, he was thinking by now. And the Bible say, Lazarus, Lazarus, come forth. He didn't call everybody out the grave. He said, he got your name. He ready to call you. Are you ready to answer? Glory to God. He said, lots of great clothes. And it was loose. And let him go. What I'm saying to you, you can be whole again. Hallelujah. I feel like shouting somebody right now. Glory to God. You're in a situation that you can't see your way out. I come and tell you, my friend, the Bible said without a vision, the people perish. Do you have a vision? Can you see God healing you? God will heal you. But you got to be ready. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Get ready. Get marks it. Go. God is ready to heal your situation. Glory to God. God can make you be whole again. Oh, glory to God. Thank you. For listening to this message, this message designed to set, to help somebody. If you can believe the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, and the God of Jacob, you can be whole again. Don't forget to subscribe to my video and thank you. A glory to God. Hallelujah, Father God, in the name of Jesus Christ. Somebody right there, oh God, in a situation they don't see their way out, oh God. If they believe in the five principles that I preach, oh, hallelujah, to them right now, oh God, heal them right now. Set them free right now. Let them believe that God is able to do exceed above all we ask or think going to power that work in us. Bless right now. Just now I pray. Amen. God bless you. Don't forget to subscribe to my video and thank you for watching.